last two years I've had 109 dogs dumped outside here. And do you know for, uh, who was it? Well, I can guess that it's probably shepherds, certainly uh, village people because of the way they, they tie them up with a rope or a piece of string or something like that. Yeah. And they don't have collars, most of them. Um, and when, about, probably about two weeks ago, I had nine dogs dumped in two days. Greek people don't castrate their animals. I mean, puppies are being dumped, dogs are being dumped, female pregnant dogs are being thrown out and you know and the thing is I think that uh, I mean all of us actually who are dealing with the animals here we're all illegal this place is illegal okay it's unbelievable yeah but they 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 are very reluctant to give permission they make it very difficult to get to uh, for us to get permission but you know they should they should see that uh, you know since the government they say they don't have money I believe that quite a bit of money is sent over for the animals but it probably so it's spent, you, yeah, yeah. Probably it's felt spent on other things. But uh, as I say, they do absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing to. Don't they frustrate? First of all, there are various reasons. Uh, I think the major reason is they think that the dog's mind gets destroyed when it's castrated. Also, it's the money issue. I don't think uh, they are prepared. I mean, even before the economic crisis, they weren't prepared to spend money, okay, on getting their dog castrated. They would prefer to spend it in a tavern, you know, eating. Yeah. It's, it's the education system here. I mean, I've been ed in education now for 28 years. I used to be a teacher here. Uh, he showed him on the internet with his ears cut off and blood all over everywhere. Through the, uh, the Greek Association and the public prosecutor, we, we took the dog. And you know, he's such a good, I think he was probably trained for fighting. He was going to fight, that's why. But he's so good, he's good with cats, he's good with other dogs. Hey. Hey, laddie, come on. Because you create trouble. And how did he do the cutting of the ears, you don't know? Probably with a knife. situation here in Crete as a vet? It, it is terrible, really, and uh, it depends on some people, because not all the people of Creta uh, do not love animals or they treat badly, but uh, some people do that yeah. and it's really bad. And and I think also it's really awful for our island. Yes, and for tourism. Yes. Because always you see dead dogs on the road and they don't clean them, eh? they don't take them away. And why did you put Coma wet? Oh, it's a long story. I used to have uh, two dogs and when I was about 15 years old, uh, a neighbour uh, poisoned them. Yes. 